god! Oh my god! Hey guys, GJC here to show you how to install Marvels on stream for Steam and how to get a setup so you can play it with your viewers on Twitch. First, you'll need to open up Steam and search in the store for Marbles on Stream. From the game page, you should be able to see an Install or a Play button. Click on it to install the game. Pick a destination folder. Read the user agreement and click the I Agree button. The game will begin installing and you can check the progress in your downloads. Once the game is installed, you can launch it. The first thing the game will ask you to do is to log in. Now it's very important that you log in with your Twitch account and not your Steam account. After you log in, you can add the game to your OBS scene. To add marbles, click on the Add New Source button. You can choose to add window capture, but I prefer to use game capture. Make sure to give your new source a good name. Most of the time, OBS will automatically detect any game that's running, but just in case, I prefer to set it to capture a specific window. Under the window selection, click on Marbles on Stream. Make sure to resize the window if you need to by right-clicking on the game source, and under Transform, choose Fit to Screen. Now drag this new source to the bottom of your source list so all your cam and overlays can be seen. Now you're ready to go live and start the game. Now that your stream has started, click on the Race tab in the game. You'll see a list of standard tracks designed by the studio. Pick a track that you want to race on. Once a track is selected, you will see two options, Viewer or Simulation. Make sure to pick the one that says Viewer. Click the Race button to begin the race. Once the track loads, click on the drop-down menu on the top right of the menu bar. Here you can see the options for setting up your timer length, and it also shows players different ways that they can enter the races. You could use one of the special emotes or by typing exclamation mark play in the chat. Streamers can join the races by clicking on one of the two join buttons. Racers who join are listed on the right. Clicking the boot symbol will kick a player from the race. The streamers and viewers can both join races also by typing exclamation mark play inside the chat. Pressing the escape key on your keyboard will show the controls for the game. The camera can be moved by using the W, S, A, and D keys, similar to a first-person shooter game. The left alt key toggles the names on the screen. The tab key locks and unlocks the cursor to allow you to click on other things such as your chat window or OBS. The F key focuses in on a marble that you target with your cursor. This will pull up a racer's profile card. To toggle the card, press the I key. Using your mouse's scrolling wheel allows you to zoom in and out when locked onto a marble. The H key hides the HUD of the game. Now you're ready to get started. Click the start button to begin the countdown for your race. Now if you don't want to wait for the full countdown to finish, you could always click it a second time to start now. Once the race begins, you can press the number 1 on your keyboard to lock onto the marble in first place. Pressing number 2 will lock onto the marble in second place, and etc. This works for all the top 10 marbles, 0 for the 10th marble. Now you're ready to play marbles on stream with your community. If you enjoyed this tutorial, make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos about marbles on stream. Please also follow me on Twitter and Twitch. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the races.